Hey there, smart shoppers. Welcome back to your favorite YouTube channel, Buy Smart, where we help you make the best purchasing decisions without breaking the bank or losing your sanity. Today, we're diving into the world of 3D printing and comparing two titans from Anycubic, the Photon Mono 2 and the Cobra 2 Neo. Which one should you invite into your workshop? Let's find out. Let's talk about the elephant in the room first. Price. The Photon Mono 2 comes in at a cool $229. Not bad, right? It's like getting a high-end gadget without needing to sell a kidney. On the other hand, the Cobra 2 Neo is just a smidge pricier at $239. 10 extra bucks. That's like giving up two lattes. So if you're super budget conscious, Photon Mono 2 might be your new best friend. But hold your horses. We've got more to unpack. Speed demons, rejoice. The Cobra 2 Neo is your new ride or die. With a max print speed of 250 millimeters per second, it's like the Usain Bolt of 3D printers. You'll get your models done in no time, leaving you with more hours to binge watch your favorite shows. Photon Mono 2, while not a slouch, is like your dependable mom's car, steady but not breaking any speed records. If you're more of a tortoise than a hare, Photon Mono 2 will still get you there. Now, size does matter, at least in the world of 3D printing. Photon Mono 2 boasts a build volume of 165 by 143 by 89 millimeters. It's like the Mary Poppins bag of 3D printers, surprisingly spacious. Meanwhile, Cobra 2 Neo doesn't flaunt its dimensions as loudly, but trust me, it still packs a punch. If you're planning on printing a life-sized replica of your cat, Photon Mono 2 might have a slight edge here. Let's talk about those crispy details. Photon Mono 2 comes with a 6.6-inch monochrome LCD screen with a 4K plus resolution. That's like having an eagle's eye for your prints. You'll see every tiny detail, every delicate curve. The Cobra 2 Neo, however, brings its A-game with a new integrated extruder and cooling system. It's like having a personal chef for your prints, ensuring everything melts and cools to perfection. Plus, with linear propulsion and input shaping, it's basically got the moves like Jagger. Are you a newbie? Fear not. Both printers are super user-friendly. Photon Mono 2 comes with the Photon Workshop 3.0, which makes slicing and dicing your models a breeze. It's like Photoshop for your 3D prints. Cobra 2 Neo, on the other hand, has Levi Q 2.0 automatic leveling. It's like having a butler that makes sure everything is perfectly balanced. So even if you're a total noob, you'll be cranking out masterpieces in no time. Last but not least, let's talk customer support. The Cobra 2 Neo offers a solid one year after service with extra support for the print head and heated bed. It's like having a warranty and a therapist rolled into one. Photon Mono 2 doesn't flaunt its customer support as much, but hey, it's any cubic. They've got your back. According to Amazon reviews, the Anycubic Photon Mono 2 is praised for its ease of setup, quiet operation, and impressive detail in prints. Users find it user-friendly and recommend it for those new to 3D printing. On the flip side, the Anycubic Cobra 2 Neo is appreciated for its fast print speeds, easy assembly, and versatile filament compatibility. However, some users noted technical issues and a learning curve, suggesting it might require a bit more tinkering to achieve optimal results. So there you have it, folks. If you're looking for speed and cutting-edge tech, the Cobra 2 Neo is your go-to. But if you want incredible detail and a slightly lower price, the Photon Mono 2 will be your new BFF. Either way, you're getting a fantastic 3D printer 
that'll make your DIY dreams come true. Thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe, and ring the bell so you never miss another episode of Buy Smart. Leave a comment below about which product you prefer and why. Product links are in the description. Until next time, keep printing and stay smart.